Director Christopher Nolan says artistic choice is the reason audiences are struggling to hear the dialogue in Oppenheimer. The filmmaker responded as BBC presenter Jane Hill, 54, admitted she left halfway through a screening and complained to the cinema staff about the volume of the dialogue. The film, starring Peaky Blinders actor Killian Murphy, tells the story of J. Robert Oppenheimer, the creator of the atomic bomb. Although the film has become a critical success, scoring 8. 7 on MB, Hill said she was disappointed that music and effects often drowned out the actors, I missed chunks of dialogue, reports The Mirror. She said staff told her, we have this issue with all Christopher Nolan films. Fellow fans said they too had noticed the issue. Hill added, I am relieved it's not just me. Yet what madness! How can you follow a film if you can't hear the actors? Barbenheimer memes mocking Hiroshima and Nagasaki bombings spark anger in Japan Nolan has now admitted the issue boils down to his choice not to use the standard industry procedure of re-recording actors in soundproof booths to be dubbed over filming at the production phase. He instead prefers to use dialogue recorded during the performance. Nolan, who had Oscar nominations for 2017's Dunkirk, 2010's Inception and 2000 hit Memento, told website Insider, I like to use the performance given in the moment rather than the actor revoice it later, which is an artistic choice that some people disagree with. The 53-year-old also uses IMAX cameras, which he has noted are not fully soundproof, though he credits their mechanical improvements to address this. Meanwhile, things are certainly sound at the box office. Oppenheimer made £33.7 million in the UK last month and is one of the highest grocers of the year, 